guys, um, I just wanted to share this little story with you. Um, when uh, Leslie and I uh, moved uh, back to Germany from uh, China, uh, we didn't have uh, much furniture, we didn't have uh, a lot of stuff that we brought with us and we really had to uh, buy a lot of things and uh, create a new household. Um, so I thought it would be nice to uh, also get some Chinese elements and there was this beautiful cupboard here which uh, I found on Spock. Um, it's opening because it's not standing on even ground so usually we use some kind of string to hold the doors together um, and uh, it's a quite a nice story because I got this um, cupboard for quite a good price I uh, paid uh, 290 euro and I thought mm, that's quite a lot but I bargained hard like from 400 what she requested I got it down to 290 and um, I think it's very beautiful you know, it has these these beautiful paintings on here from ancient China. It's some delegations, some get-togethers here with music and stuff. Um, really, really beautiful piece of work. If you see that here, and um, yeah, then later on, accidentally, I. Uh, was looking through a little catalog that I got from my aunt from a um, yeah um, from a furniture shop that is selling furniture and household uh, items and clothes and things um, from different countries like an intercultural thing and um, I found my cupboard you know you won't believe it here and it actually says here it's the number one. It's the Ling Hai cupboard with a metal and uh, from the province Zhejiang and it's 120 years old. Um, that was like 10 years ago, so it's already 130 years old according to this uh, a catalog. And uh, it's supposed to have a price from 750 to 850 euro. Um, so I think my 290 euro are really a catch. And I'd love to uh, buy some more of this kind of furniture and um, items from China and maybe make a little trade business with it. Um, did you try that already? Do you have some experiences with it? Um, then maybe you can give me some tips because I really love this cupboard. I hardly want to sell it again, but of course if I get like, who knows, 600 euro, 500 euro for it. Um, of, uh, I would really consider selling it again and buy another one and uh, maybe you have done something like that already um, and can share your experiences looking forward to it um, yeah if you want to see some more of our intercultural China uh, Germany uh, experiences just uh, subscribe to our channel and um, thanks for your support mm -hmm.